Let's turn now to our climate in crisis. So we've talked about this. California's coastline is constantly changing. And to keep track of those impacts, a group of scientists at Scripps Institution of Oceanography is using advanced technology. So here to give us more insight is meteorologist VNA Arana. Uh, VNA, so we've obviously seen changes in our coastal area, some spots actually even collapsing. We've covered these stories. Uh, are those the areas that they're analyzing with this advanced technology? Exactly. And, you know, we've seen it everything from homes, you know, teetering off the mountain tops to one that we all know here and that's Big Sur Highway 1. It's facing constant issues with sort of a troubling future ahead and they're using technology like this to help us better understand the how and the why and also the future planning uh, so things can change as we you know experience climate change. Now they go out once a week and they use a laser mapping system called LIDAR which stands for light detection and ranging. Their goal is to understand how, when, and where coastal bluffs fail. They're able Able to compare even the smallest changes at the beach from the week or even the year before. So this data really goes far back as well. Researchers hope to use this information to build better models to help predict how our coastline is going to evolve. Predicting when and where a landslide is going to occur is, is extremely difficult. Definitely there are things that we can look for. You can tend to get repeated events in the same area over time and so a landslide can be active over a period of weeks or days or months. And Big Sur is a, a perfect example of that. Now, the recent El Nino may be a glimpse into those changes, even though, as you see, we're transitioning out of the El Nino pattern. Ocean levels rise slightly during an El Nino year, and combine that with heavy rain, king tides, and a couple of days with huge waves this past winter, and it's certainly a recipe for erosion, which we have seen. You can see the images there. Now, if you want to learn more about this technology, we're going to post this story at NBCBayArea.com. Just make sure to check out the class climate in crisis tab. We have other stories just like this that talks about things like erosion mm -hmm. and sea level rise, which as you know, the Bay Area is extremely prone to. A lot of our coastal communities are directly impacted by this year after year. Sure. It's amazing to see what advanced technology is allowing us to do now just to Certainly be better prepared. Is. And we'll link the uh, data available for that specific uh, technology as well. Hey, sounds good, VNA. Thank you. you got it.